I do hope you're doing well. So, you know if there's a Home Sense haul, there's going to be a TK Maxx one. I mean, you just can't do one without the other, can you? So, in today's haul, we have one huge bag filled with some lovely decorative bits and two <clears throat> jam-packed heavy ones, which you can hear the clang-clang. So, let me tell you a little secret. There's some candles in there, all right? So, we are not going to ramble. I want to get into this. It smells phenomenal in this room right now so let's get in with our autumnal i love that word <gasps> autumnal tk max haul <laughs> right well, let's just start off with one of the baby bags but oh my god this is probably my most favorite thing from the haul so we all know i love a pumpkin right when i saw this i just had to get it it was 7.99 and it's kind of like a mohair style pumpkin Oh my god, my lovelies, look at this. It's a little knitted mohair white pumpkin with a nice little brown tree stalk. $7.99. So as soon as I saw that, she was the last one left, you had to go with me. The lady said it could be used as a doorstop, but I don't feel it's that weighty enough. So I think I will probably just put this in the hallway as a little decorative piece. Or if there's room in my room, it'll go. But literally, I'm looking at the setup now and I don't think I'm going to have much more room to put bits at. So this may be a whole one to go with. Oh my God, it looks so cute next to the big guy from the Home Sense haul, the big bumblebee guy. If you've seen it, you'll know. If you haven't, I'll leave it down there up above. I think they would look really cute together. Da, 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 da. Right. On our last TK Maxx or Home Sense haul, I picked up a room spray, which was from Sand and Fog, and I didn't know they'd done it. Picked it up, $4.99, Berry Scents, smelled delicious. Well, I didn't know DW Home done one either. DW Home do a room and linen spray. It's all the same jazz. And you know what? Sometimes, now we're coming into the festivities, I will spray this kind of as like a body spray sometimes. If I just want to smell like an autumnal goddess, which... With this hair, I look a bit like a pumpkin, don't I? But hey-ho, we're not going to mention it. If you don't have anything nice to say about the hair, don't. Each to their own. And I just love bright colours. I, What can I say? I'm not frightened with my hair. So, yes, yeah, sometimes when I want to go out and I want to smell as autumnal as my hair is, I will use these as a body spray. So, I picked up the DW Home Apple Cider. Again, $4.99, same price as Sand and Fog. But... I sprayed this earlier this smells so good you know like a freshly baked apple pie but you can tell it's boozy there's plenty of cider and a, maybe a little bit of brandy in there too but yes room and linen spray and i love the color i love that it's burgundy it's gonna fit perfectly in and i think this smells good enough to drink i wouldn't advise drinking it but if you do like a bit of mulled apple cider oh my god roll on november because i don't think they start doing mold wine and mold ciders until november time because it is more of a christmas thing but hey ho from september i'm all here for a bit of mold wine and apple cider right i picked this little guy up he was 3.99 and say so he's more for the autumnal stage of it look it's like a little robin redbreast but i don't think it is a robin redbreast it's just like a very autumnal bird so he is a tea light holder but because it's got quite a good depth on it you could have it as a say like maybe a trinket dish whatever you prefer but i think i will have him as a little tea light holder i'm just looking where i can fit him but oh oh he's got a little chip on his nose oh i didn't see that when i picked him up oh i'll have to paint you in with like a little bit of orange nail polish that's not a problem absolutely love that though don't know where i'm gonna put him once again the room is filled with all the autumnal goodies 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 and talking of goodies when i saw this because i've seen this on quite a few people's instagrams and i was like you know what i love the whole aesthetics of that it's a white candle but it's got an autumnal scent i love the little top on the candle lid which you'll see in a minute and when i saw it i made a beeline for it so this was 6.99 and it was from a company called red leaf home that coconut and beeswax blend with essential oils i've never had this you know me i'm either sand and fog or dw home or as you would have seen in the home since one dw neutrals or naturals that they've got a new little range but red leaf home i've never 
never heard of. I picked up the Butternut Pumpkin Candle. Right. First of all, just look at the packaging. Look at that little label. How rustic is that? And then that was what I said about the lid. I love the little, you can actually just pop it off. And then my lovelies. I wish you could just smell this with me. It is absolutely gorgeous. So once again, it is just a neutral colour candle to match the holder. But honestly, it's sweet without being too sweet. I think the butternut gives it like, it's going to sound weird, not a veggie smell, but the butternut balances it. And yes, I just love that. Super rustic. And as I say, what I like to do with these, when I find a soul that I really like in the jars, once it's melted down, clean it out and then I'll use it as like a little holder or bring it out every autumn and then we can put like I know potpourri or bits like that in it I just I do love that little holder on the top and as I say it's like sand and fog they have all the drawings on the tops of our candle lids it's just the little details but the little details are what make me smile and I'll tell you what did make me smile is this lovely huge fella here so you're not chipped are you Mr Fox no, you're all good. This was only $6.99, which I didn't think personally was too bad for something this size. So, can you tell I kind of have gone like a little bit fox crazy? So, spring, summer, we had the bee obsession that I had. And now I've had a fox obsession. Because in Home Sense, I picked up a fox little ornament with a tartan scarf and a fox plant pot holder. And now we've got the big guy. So, as I say, he was $6.99. Very good size, absolutely love it, and it's just his little foxy colour all the way round. But oh, I just love you, and we match. Oh my god, we actually do match. Look at that. So my hair is sunshine orange slash foxy locks. Oh my god, foxy locks. We've got it going on, haven't we? Absolutely love that. And he is the last little guy from the first bag. One out of three, done. Right, I think we might go into the big bag because I just can't contain myself and I want to get a mat already. So, yeah. right, you would have seen from the autumn room tour, actually, that won't be up yet, but when you see the autumn room tour, there is a throw on the bed, which was when I done my deep clean. And we put the woodland theme bedding on, which is what I've got. I put on my Asda woodland animal throw. I've kind of got in a habit now of changing my throw every two weeks to match the bedding. It all started with the bee bedding. TK Maxx have a lot to answer for. Because if I didn't see those two throws, the sunshine yellow and the grey bee printed throw, I don't think it would have started me on the bee obsession. But... From there, it was just a bit downhill. So, we got the bee bed in. And for two weeks of August, I had the sunshine yellow throw. And two weeks, I had the bee bed in throw. Now, we've come to September and I've got the woodland animal throw. So, obviously, I've got the matching woodland animal theme throw. I lost my words there. But, Home Sense and TK Maxx, their throws are just divine. So, this was $9.99, which first of all, I think is a bargain. I picked one up last year for Halloween, which obviously is going to make a comeback. And it's a big white one with like all the dogs and animals in like fancy dress Halloween costumes. So that's coming out. I need to get another Halloween throw then. Because if I'm having two autumn, I need two for Halloween. That's food for thought. But the throw that I picked up is almost like a rustic farmyard but it's got the pumpkins in i don't know if you can see that so it's all like natural leaves pumpkins gray pumpkins orange pumpkins and i absolutely loved it when i saw it i thought like 17 quid because it was like decorative so i thought it would be the same price as the two i had before but 9.99 9.99 so you didn't have to tell me twice that went straight in the trolley and yeah roll on when i can change the woodland throw to this one because i don't want to get my face on it it is so soft super super soft and i said this in my home since i think these are softer than primark throws maybe an unpopular opinion but i just love them the size the comfort the cuteness 
I just, ah, oh, I love it. So, come on, of course, if I've got a throw, there's going to be something else here, isn't there? Right. This was a little bit more pricey. This was $14.99. Right. First off, when I was thinking of autumnal cushions, obviously from Home Sense we've got the more neutral pumpkin and the jazzy pumpkin. I wanted to try and get like a couple of different sizes. So I thought, right, we'll have a couple, maybe rectangular, some square, because I have still got from many, many moons ago my Halloween cushions like my skull and Peggy. Actually, I don't think I'll bring Peggy out. I'll bring the skull one out. So if I was trying to think autumn, like what is an autumn cushion apart from pumpkins, obviously. And then I was walking through TK Maxx and I saw this and I thought, hmm. And you know what it's like? It's one of its own. It wasn't in the cushion section. It was in like the glassware. God knows why on earth it was in the glassware. It was just on the top shelf. And I just saw the corner print, which was that, my lovely. So that was all I saw. And I thought, oh, let's go and have a look at that. So let me just make sure. Yes. This is the back of it so it's a double sided one once again like the big black pumpkins from home since this is the plain side so that's fabulous you can have it like that if you don't want a jazzy one that is not a problem loved it i thought it's autumnal colors it's like autumn leaves absolutely fabulous when i turned it round da -da -da, it says family and oh it just melted my heart and i knew that was coming straight home with me. I think this is going to be something that obviously I'm going to have for years and years to come now. And I can just see whether it be on my bed or in the living room. No one is sitting against this. Let me tell you that. No one will be squishing this cushion because it was a very nice, you know, that nice wadding, almost like it's not goose feather. But you know, like when you go to a hotel and they have them really nice wadding pillars. That is what this is like. And oh, I just love it. The gold is almost like glistening. A bit like a glittery writing and I love the font, love that it's like an italic calligraphy and I just love the border around it. There was not a lot to say. I saw that and as I say, after I had that, obviously I paired the two up to see like, are they going to go because that's pumpkins, this is leaves. It goes fine. So I cannot wait to have a little rejig with my cushions because I think I'll put the family one there, the pumpkin and then pumpkin, have it like in a scattered effect. And then for October, I can bring out the skull cushion from, where did I get that? I think it was a place in Julianham many, many moons ago, but I say, absolutely love it. And yes, I absolutely, I just can't say it anymore. I think this, alongside the crochet pumpkin, are my favourite things from the haul. I mean, I just, I absolutely love that. And as I say, if you are on the lookout for a good autumnal cushion and you want something, I think this is very understated because where it's like the cream and the neutrals, you obviously have a bit of colour with the autumnal leaves. But let's say if you didn't want the big family, you could just have it with the leaves on. But I do think that makes it. And I do think it looks a lot more expensive than $14.99. You could maybe go into the likes of Zara Home, H&M Home. I would think I haven't shopped in there before, but it looks very expensive. Like, you know, people look at that and I'd be like, please don't sit on it. So yes, I've got a new cushion. We're just going to pop you there for the minute until I decide where you go. Oh, it's a fabulous length as well. I am excited. So let's roll on to bag number three, my lovelies. And the final bag, which is the heaviest and oh my god, we have got some goodies in here. So this is a really autumnal fired, autumnal fired, autumn fired, whatever the word is I'm trying to think of. But I saw it and I wanted it. So this was $3.99 and it is unicorn birthday cake cotton candy. I'm sorry, what? Look at that and then it has all the different colours so you've got a pastel pink like a pastel purple blue white and more pink and you know what can i open it because i am starving oh right it's all sealed not anymore we're gonna have a taste test so unicorn birthday cake let's see what this tastes like hey eh? oh my god there is nothing better 
than a fresh pack of candy floss. So let's not try to take too much. We're not going to be a gannet, but let's try it, shall we? Okay, I need to stop myself. Oh, I will probably sit and eat all of that tonight. As you'll know, if you've been following us from like past month or so, I've been having quite a bit of chip with me gob. Probably because I wrap it too much, but I had wisdom teeth start to come through this side. Then I started to have wisdom teeth coming up this side, so opposites. And then I don't know what I've done. I think I've burnt my tongue, but I must have burnt it pretty bad because underneath, trying to stretch it, oh, that hurts so much. And I've got like a little bobble at the bottom, which I think means I've burnt it because I had it a few months back, but this time it's taken a lot longer to go. So this type of food is just what the dentist ordered probably not because it's full of sugar and probably will rot my teeth anymore but i don't care i have it and that was blue and delicious they had some other flavors i wish i'd have got them now this is what i mean i try and be good and think oh, i'll just get the one but then i always end up regretting so i think in life my love is if you see something you want just get it because you're only going to regret it after ain't you so yes I will be on the hunt for another one of them when I next go back because, of course, I'm going to have to go back October, ain't I? And duh. Right. Oh, this little guy was cute. So, from the stuff that I had last year, I've got quite a few, like, blues and teal bits. So, when I saw this little guy, and it was two ninety nine, two ninety nine. So, I thought, you've just got to come home with me. You've just got to come straight in the trolley. Look. It's like a little ceramic. I'm going to say... Oh my goodness. Ah, everything's falling. Oh my goodness. Thank God that dropped on the carpet and not on the tripod leg. Because I would have smashed you. And you're really cute. As I was saying before, I clumsily dropped it because, as we all know, I'm butterfingers. It's like a little owl. That's what I'm going to say is a little owl or just a bird of some kind. But yes, absolutely love that for 2 I wish I'd have got more. Again, look at this. I wish I'd have got two of them. I wish I'd have got the other candy floss. But no. Right, let's go in with another candle, shall we? So, oh no. I've got the same candle from HomeSense, but it's a completely different packaging oh that's naughty that's like confusing people so if you remember from the home sense i got a little maple hazelnut and it was like a lovely mustard yellow frosty tin with a gold lid this one is deep orange black writing and a black lid oh but it does smell divine so i'm not gonna moan about it aye 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 2.99 again I've got the DW Home Maple Hazelnut. But you know what? I'm not going to lie because it is a lovely scent. So I can have one in the toilet and one in the bathroom. But why would they do the same scent in two different styles? Maybe a light or a dark one. Maybe it's like for your aesthetics. So if you wanted more like the dark Halloween-y autumn style. Or the more neutral light yellow with the white right in and the gold lid. Oh, well, I'm not complaining. I've got two of them. And as I say, they are 2 the little DW homes. 2 for those. And then I think the mediums are between 5 and 6 And the large ones, I think, are 12 I don't ever really buy the large ones. The biggest size, I will get are mediums. But I do love quite a lot of, like, small ones. I can't help it. I think the Diddy ones are just oh so cute. Oh so cute. And oh, we all know I love a good biscuit. And when I saw these, these are Cantuccini Ayi Pistachio e Mandala. It's basically Cantuccini with pistachios and almonds. But they remind me of like a biscotti biscuit. So these were 2 dollars and you get a nice little pack there. So these are great to dip in coffee, but I don't waste my time dipping them in coffee. I just have them as a snack. So as I say, two ninety nine. dollars How many do you get? 3, 6, 9, 12, 15... 18 pieces so not too bad but oh pistachios and almonds i'm not really a pistachio fan 
but I think it'll be nice with the almonds. So we're going to stick with those. Can't wait to put them in my cookie jars. Well, biscuit jars. We're just going to call them in the kitchen, right? And then, oh, I've got two things left, but I don't know if I should save the best till last. Yeah, we're going to save the best till last. Right, moving on. Another baby candle, and this is from DW Home, and this is, I think, more of the aesthetically, like, frosted style. This is maple pancakes. Rich and sweet and comforting. Rich maple, caramelised sugar and pancake butter combined with the essence of pumpkin and toasted nuts. Two ninety nine once again. So as I say, if you do want to get in the autumnal spirit, my lovelies, but you don't want all the bright oranges and the mustard yellows and all of that, DW Home, Sand and Fog, they do great, like almost like the aesthetics range. So if you don't want the bright colours like mine are, you can get the plain ones exactly like Red Leaf Home. They have like some aesthetically ones as well, but... I've never really been a waffle or a pancake type of girl, but, I mean, if you used to give me a stack of pancakes and laid all this type of syrup over it, I wouldn't be mad. In fact, I would congratulate you and be like, pass me some more. So, yes, I say maple pancakes. Oh, absolutely love that. And my lovelies. Shall we see the best thing? Oh, I say the best thing, but I love the throw... And the cushion, let's just say the best candle, right? So, if you remember from, it was like kind of a spring, summer, Home Sense or TK Maxx haul, I can't remember which one. But I picked up a gnome. Now, the gnome from the outside just looked maybe like a cookie jar. And then you opened the lid and he was, in fact, a candle. The lady said to me, when I went to the teal with this, she said there's going to be a Christmas collection. So best believe I'm going to be on the hunt for a Christmas one of these. Because then I will have the set. So, the spring summer one I had was kind of like baby blue, baby pink. And this was the one that took my eye for the autumnal period. It was $14.99, so it is a lot more expensive than, say, DW Home or the Red Leaf Home for a candle. But the way I look at it, you're getting like a cookie jar or a biscuit jar after. So these are by the brand The Farmhouse Rachel Ashwell. And it is scented white pumpkin, which, first of all, smells phenomenal. But when you see this little guy, let's just move the tag so you can get him in his full entirety, right? Oh my god, look at him. He's even holding his sunflowers. Look, he's got three little sunflowers there he's holding. And then would you look at this? One, two, three, et voila. And you've got a gorgeous double wick candle, which... Oh, it's just delightful. It is absolutely delightful. Oh, my God. You are just so cute. I need to put you back on so that you have the little sunflower on your hat. But honestly, my lovelies, when I saw this, I was like, I don't care. I know you're pricey, but you're coming home to me because I see you not just as a candle. I see you as maybe like even a little plant pot, like a potting plant pot. I think that's what it's called a biscuit jar, a utensil jar, you're going to be used for everything and you're going to be a well-loved member of the family like your little spring friend was. Even though I never burnt him, he's going to be burnt for next spring and oh my God, I don't know if I want to burn him either. Would I save you and then you could be like burnt on the first autumn in the home? Oh, you've got a little mark on your beard. Oh, it's a little bit of glue. I mean, guys, I just can't cope. I just can't cope with him. I need to name them, I think. Hopefully, if I can get the Christmas one, we'll have, like, a little set of three. Then we could, like, maybe do some names for them. But, oh, I just need to show you him again. How fabulous is he? Oh! Ah! $15.99, the farmhouse, Rachel Ashwell. Go and have a look. If they do online, saying that, I haven't looked online. Oh, my God, imagine if I go online and there's a big, like, family of them. I'm going to have to get them all, ain't I? I know what I'm going to be doing after this haul, but my lovelies, my bed is filled with pumpkins, a lovely little gnome jar, 
food, throws, candles, sprays. I think that has been a very good haul. I'm going to have another bit of candy floss and then we'll have a little round up in the outro, shall we? So my lovelies, that is the end of our autumnal TK Maxx haul. And can you believe we're at this season again? If you're an OG from last year and you remember we had the hair transformation last year kicking off the autumnal vlogs and here we are a year later, I will leave the autumn winter 2020 playlist down there up above, you know the drill. If you just kind of want to reminisce, see me with another bright colour hair which is not orange slash copper slash ginger, whatever you want to call it, it's called sunshine orange, alright? And yes, I cannot wait to get the rest of this in my room do you know how long i've been waiting to film this but i couldn't do anything because i wanted my hair imagine me filming this and i had my dreary drab root raw hair that was just meh. Meh, 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 meh but now it's all done i look like a pumpkin so i can show you the pumpkins and yes i am hungry it was very hard to stop eating that candy floss, I'm not going to lie. It's extremely tasty. I cannot wait to start smelling like apple cider. But it is now wanting me to have a glass of apple cider. And don't really know if I should be drinking tonight because work tomorrow and all of that jazz. But hey-ho, maybe kick it off for autumn with just a little touch of alcohol, eh? Who knows? I probably won't. I'll probably have my pumpkin spice latte and go kick because we have... I don't know if you can see in the back. We have the pumpkin spice latte candle burning. And I've also got my little hedgehog mug, which I got from Home Sense, which has probably by now got a cold cup of tea in it. <laughs> this is what happens. I start yakking and then I completely forget because I get sidetracked with cushions, gnomes, the lot, you name it. But if you did enjoy the video, guys, you know what to do. Hit that thumbs up and subscribe down below. And say, leave me a comment. What was your favourite bit from the haul? What are you looking forward to for autumn? Have you seen any bits in your local TK Maxx that you think Shan needs to know about that? She will absolutely love that. Please do let me know. As I say, I don't care if they're a bit far away because I love a road trip. And if it's for autumnal home wear, I am there. And the only time when I get more excited for a season is Christmas. And that's not going to be far away either, is it, my lovelies? So... I'm going to stop rabbiting on and let you get on with your day. I need to go and finish decorating my room. I can't put the throw out just yet. I've got two more weeks until that can go out. Finish my candy floss, decorate with my pumpkins and spray my room with apple cider, room and linen spray from DW Home at the lovely price of $4.99. Thank you very much. But yes, take care and stay safe as always, guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.